Hello friends, welcome to Selenium Point. My name is Harshal and I am going to teach you Selenium from scratch. So let's start with today's tutorial. It's about Selenium tooltip handling. Here is a daily tutorial. Before start, let me explain you the scenario and the actual function flow. So uh, for that you have to go to the test website, login using the existing credential or your own credential. Okay, once you log into the website, you can see the test website, a dummy e-commerce website over here. In earlier tutorials, we have already seen the window handling, tab handling, frame handling and the alert handling. Now we are going to see the tooltip text. So what is tooltip? Let me explain you that. Once you over the mouse on this page, on this product, Nikon, you can see a tooltip is offered Nikon D50. It is visible and invisible once you move the mouse. Okay, so uh, in many time testing scenarios, we need to identify or you need to assert the tooltip text as well. So with this product, the tooltip text is Nikon D50. So let's print this text using Selenium WebDriver. Uh, before that, let me explain you the exact uh, property, HTML property of tooltip. So inspect this i will explain you it has a tooltip nikon d50 okay so you can see uh, the same highlighted code for this text and it has a data toggle tooltip and the title is a nikon d5 that title is nothing but the tooltip text so you have to get that property of title and if you are able to get the property, that means you will able to get the tooltip text. So let's see with the Selenium. Create a new class. Tooltip text. Okay, just log into website. This is code. I already explained many times for login open the Firefox open the URL and login using the existing credential that means it will enter these two credential username password and hit the submit button now we we'll, will come to this page now tooltip handling okay now you have to get the tooltip of this this text or this uh, link so get the xpath of this text first for getting the xpath or id or name just inspect it you can see here there is no id or no in xpath here uh, no here so just get the view xpath using xpath checker tool double slash you can see it comes under product one name it has a div class product one name inside div class there is a, a tag so div property that the red class is equal to product one name product one name it is a case sensitive so it, it has given you a name but in that name this is a link so this is white color so see you can see here nikon d5 so this is a correct expert only one match is here it should be a unique xpath so nikon d50 for this xpath is this so string tooltip text is equal to driver dot find element by xpath dot get attribute and the attribute is a title you can see here when you inspect this the tooltip text was nikon d50 which is the title right so get the attribute title that's it so it will get the tooltip text and just for consumption print out this see how tooltip text Let's run this program. 
it will open the browser it will log into the website yeah it is logged in and it has printed the tooltip Nikon D50 that's it guys it is so easy to get the tooltip text for more information go to my website in tutorial section you will get the same thing same tutorial here I will post the videos here so you will get the information as well and the code is here which is ready made you can directly paste into your Eclipse and run the code uh, you can use the test website for rendering or for your practices so keep watching the same videos please subscribe my channel so you will get the notifications thank you thank you guys for watching the videos